Doja. Not really a rapper. Um, more of a pop star. They're positioning her as a rapper to compete with Nicki Minaj. She's ripping off Nicki Minaj's style. It's very obvious to hear. Um, she's trying to rap like Nicki. Trying to, they're trying to redesign Nicki with Doja. She's the only real actual competition for Nicki. Because Cardi B isn't competition. She's just opposition. Doja isn't opposition, but she is competition. They've made her competition because they want to deem her as a rapper. So if you put her in the rap category, her streams go toe-to-toe with Nicki, when she's really kind of more of a pop star. So please get that, Jay. But, you know, with Doja, I really don't like her that much. I think she's okay. She's just weird as fuck, and she's really not black. Like, this is a problem that I'm having with her in, in Lotto. And I'm glad Nikki called Lotto a Karen because she is. Um, you know, the only thing stopping Doja from passing as white is her natural hair. Because back in the day, she would have passed as white. She could have definitely. If she would have plopped on a Karen wig, she would. She could have easily passed as a white woman. She looks like a white woman. She does not look black. She has the face of a white woman. She has white features. Um, Lotto has some black features, but her hair and her skin are so light, you know, she can pass as white. Like, but the drop of black in these girls is giving them the pass to say the N-word. Thus, they can become rappers and they can play up in black people's spaces. And that is because the industry is run by their white, you know, oo-ish, you know what I mean, dads. I didn't say the J. Ooish daddies who run the industry and allow them to play up in black people's spaces. And then black people are so disenfranchised and so psychologically fucked, you know, that we just accept any old body into our community because Lotto and Doja Cat shouldn't be accepted. In my, in my opinion, they are white women who the one little drop of black in them is allowing them to say the N word and thus they can become rappers when they really shouldn't be rapping in the first place. With Doja, I'm wishing her the best. She's a semi-rapper. Um, you know, she raps part-time and um, she's not that good. You know, she doesn't really have, she, she's okay, but she doesn't have Nicki's bars. She's a great songwriter. I think she she does. Like, Streets is a very good songwriter. She has good songwriting skills, but I think she should just be a pop star. Like, why can't we just have a black pop girl? Like, we have Rihanna, who brings, like, a Caribbean vibe. Doja has her own energy. She has her own vibe. Like, you know, she needs to just compete with Dua Lipa and Ariana Grande and Taylor Swift. She's not really a rap girl. So I'm wishing Doja the best. She's all right. You know, I don't really feel, I'm very indifferent to her. She's okay. Like, she has, a, I only know, like, two of her songs. Other, like, maybe three. Say So, Streets, and Woman. Other than that, I don't really know her music. And then, like, oh, I like Get Into It, yeah. You know, so just a few, but I really, I really can't, like, go, you know, deep with Doja's music. I don't know it like that. She's all right. Wishing her the best.